Townen, and welcome to the Bottle Cap Brigade, the best D&D campaign you'll ever encounter. We're the live stream that gets drunk, talks about D&D, but doesn't play it right. That's right. How we play D&D is just like forced family time. It's much better when you've had a couple shots. <laughs> <laughs> or the whole bottle. <laughs> hey. <laughs> uh, well, let's introduce the bottle cap crew. Our first player is Facebook's greatest political evangelist. It's Sam Gates. <laughs> <laughs> that was accurate. <laughs> You recklessly attack your foes. He's your pretty phone. intense. Don't mess with him on Yeah, don't. Uh, uh, yeah, don't. Yeah. <laughs> He's just as articulate in real life. I love it. I love it. I'm so glad he said Dude, I fucking... I, I have been going hard over the last two fucking three weeks-ish. Uh, it has been hard for people to deal with. So. Open your mind! It's a great way of words. Well, uh, just like trying to argue with Sam, it's a similar vibe. Did you know that banging your head against a wall for one hour burns 150 calories? It's Taylor Hawker <laughs> as Togu. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, what are... <laughs> Always remember, when you're feeling down and like the world is against you, at least you're not Joe as Tax Slash Ferret. <laughs> 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 Oh man! Well, <laughs> it's always a joke. Joe always gets a mean one. I will I never I forget I uh, what smells like tuna. Did someone bring tuna? Yeah, that was a mean one. Joe, I, I, don't, know. I don't know. Does something smell like tuna? Yeah. Or is it Joe Fred? <laughs> yes, the they're whole. synonymous. Uh, this next person is every toilet's arch enemy. It's Janelle Christine as Tyrion. <laughs> Taco Bell. <laughs> I'm the Taco Bell. Oh man! Our second to last player eats food in the nude, and we're not sure if he's really a dude. It's Austin Bond Johnson hey. as Eric. I'll never tell. <laughs> we'll never know. Uh, okay. In your pants, boss. The last player is is very dear to my heart, um, and you know that feeling when you want to cry with joy because you finally got that job offer, or you committed to a goal and you finally reached it, or even you this finally got the nerve to ask someone out and they said yes. Well, this person is nothing like that. It's Miranda Hankilla Palacio <laughs> as Jolene. Hey. Uh, hi. Hi. Yeah. hi. Well, uh, now that we've introduced everyone, I think it's about time that Sam had something to say. Sam? <clears throat> <laughs> do you think about rolling waves of grain? Do you think about the Statue of Liberty when you wake up every morning? Do you think about how America, the land of the free and the home of the brave, has evolved from century to century to grow into this giant goddamn fucking nightmare that we are today? I hope you do, because if that's the case, then God bless you and God bless America. And I'll tell you what, if, if, if we can't beat a pandemic, and if we can't beat systemic racism, and if we can't beat, beat the, the rough edges of capitalism down into a squishy little ball of shit, then we're not goddamn red-blooded fucking Americans. I'll tell you what, so if you're a red-blooded American like me, if you're a red-blooded American like Austin and Taylor and Joe and Miranda and Austin and Janelle and this goddamn fucking eagle, then you should subscribe to our Patreon and buy some <laughs> dice from Dice Envy. Thank you and fucking God bless America. Praise the Lord. Oh my God. <laughs> Thank you for that. Uh, I feel right. patriotic as fuck. Well, I didn't want to stand up because my, my crop should be in the camera. <laughs> I regret my standing up. <laughs> I ripped that entire thing. Well, yeah, he, that, that's improv. <laughs> Was that good? Was that good? Okay. <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> We lost Taylor. We haven't started yet. <laughs> per usual. It's pretty normal. And Miranda has no idea what's going on. That's just great. <laughs> well, I, re I repeated oh, a shit. phrase from that little patron thing. I'm said, sweating. We so can't funny. beat systemic oh, racism, oh. capitalism, and our meat. What can we be? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Other people's meat. Oh, oh. man. Brilliant. All right. Here, well, without Stop further ado, you know. let's score some bottle caps. Yeah. Welcome yeah. to episode yeah. 23. Yeah.
Me? Find yourself. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Ah! Yeah, it worked Thank you. Sorry. Good job. I always forget about it. You know, it's something I made up. <laughs> it's your thing. <laughs> the deserts are a mysterious place full of majesty, wonder, death, and life. Our heroes have certainly discovered all four of these things in their journeys. The group is separated, with Togu and Eridra seemingly dead or missing. They found their belongings, belongings uh, for both of them, both bloodied and broken items no longer in their possession. Unbeknownst to the main party, but beknownst to us, the two of them did survive, or did they? So much truth is clouded with the discovery of Togu's corpse while he clearly remained alive, standing in front of it. Ong, Tak, Jolie, and Tiyuya. You sit in a bumping cart bouncing along the desert pathways on your journey for the pirate city of Souther. It's been eight years, eight hours. <laughs> it's been eight hours, eight years. It's been eight hours since you joined the fisherman's caravan heading for the small town of Carmiel. Tax road sickness is finally starting to subside, having vomited four times off the edge of the cart. <laughs> Ong narrowly avoided these puking sessions, walking alongside the caravan on foot the entire way, and is beginning to feel an ache in his legs. Jolie, you look over to Tack, and you see his face turn white again, a sure sign that he's not feeling well, and you feel bad for him. In the session, That's a cue, you guys. I just watched her stare into the microphone. Tack, is it? Are you nauseous? Is it your belly? Is it more of a headache thing? How can I help heal you? It's bad oatmeal, <laughs> but it's so where good. Did, where did you get the oatmeal from? I I found it on the ground. Not sure it's oatmeal, I, but. You found it on the ground? Yeah. It looks like oatmeal. Did it did it taste like it? No. Are you sure? No. Okay. I've never had okay. oatmeal before. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jesus Christ. Why don't why don't you uh, I'm gonna take I'm that. Gonna Magna. <laughs> why why do you come here? I'll uh I'll give you a, I'll sing you a little lullaby. Yeah, cigarette. <laughs> oh, cigarette. <laughs> Um, and I cast, uh, oh shit. I'll give you a, a healing word. What is the word? <laughs> Bird is the word. Oh, nice. Yeah. Turn up! Ya la la! Ya la la! Ya la la! Oh. Oh. You feel that? <laughs> You, Nine. you feel wow. significantly better. I have full health. <laughs> anyway, this is great. <laughs> you have full health, you said it to me. Thank you, Julie. Yeah, you're If you will. find any oatmeal, let me know. I'm still hungry. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure that oatmeal wasn't oatmeal. I'm pretty sure it was just. I don't camel know what oatmeal shoot. is. <laughs> camel I saw one of the camels puke back there uh, before we left, so maybe it was that. I'll, if I see a camel puke, I'll. Taste it and let you know. <laughs> you probably have any well. stuff on the ground, Tack. Hey, whatever. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Bunch of adults over here. Yeah, I mean, I am 13 and a half, so. Pretty adult. When's your birthday? Do you celebrate those? <laughs> I haven't had a birthday. What's a birthday? <laughs> What does a calendar well, year look like in Magna? <laughs> uh, seven. Okay. Seven. <laughs> My birthday is also seven. seven. <laughs> weird, me too. That is so weird. Mine is seven. Oh, wow. Do we all have the same birthdays? Um, My birthday is 1,080. I knew it. However, I believe that that is potentially divisible by the number seven. Oh my god, we all have the same fucking birthday. Shit. Shit. What sign does that make us? Camels. <laughs> the what? Camel. The what? Oh, the year of the camel. Yeah. From the Ergonasi zodiac. <laughs> that's right. That's right. 
Yeah. Ergis, you were talking about that too. I remember. Oh wait, Ergis isn't with us. I was Never gonna mind. say, you guys are lucky. I'm not there. I would have been. I miss him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the the calendar is broken into seven. It's called the seven divisions. <laughs> I just wrote that down because I just committed to that. <laughs> I, uh, so I, I'm sitting there on the little wagon or whatever, and I'm going to, like, kind of yell out to, who's, like, the nearest person to me that's, like, in this caravan that's not in our party? That's, like, a native or something. Oh, yeah, I mean, you're, you're in, you're in Colin's cart. Yeah. So he's riding the cart, and then yeah. his wife, Carly. Aww. I think her name changed a couple times in the session, but both yeah. well, Carly. But you're right. Hey, Colin. Now, what can I do for you? So, we've been on these, this ride for like a while. I was just wondering, what, are we there yet? <laughs> well, yeah, are we there yet? I'd say we've, we're about mm, 300 bird spans away from being halfway. Uh, how big is the bird? <laughs> Oh, uh, do you you mean a a, a a southern swallow or an African swallow? <laughs> well, I don't know that. Like blue, wait, no, big Sorry. giant, like a, like this. I just put my arms in like this big of a bird, or like you know, like a bird, like a monster bird. Well, I've seen some pretty big I birds. That. I love when that happens. I am sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, I mean, I mean, yeah, bird, you know, like, 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 like a raven. Okay, like that thing. Like, you know, a raven, a raven. So, okay, so here's the problem. We'll be there in a couple saying, hours. <laughs> Perfect, because like I've seen ravens and then I've seen were ravens and they're like half people, so you gotta be You've specific. You've seen were ravens? Well, yeah. Oh, it's woodshop. I wonder where woodshop is. Huh. What's a wood chop? I don't worry about Colin. Okay. And he's like, the rest of the day, he's like, wood chop, wood chop, wood chop. Just couldn't stop worrying about it. Am I within a earshot of this? Yeah, you heard everything. Uh, I, I'd like to turn back and just say, uh, to you, yeah, don't don't worry about our little friend. I'm sure he will be soon uh, with us once again and uh, hanging out soon, hopefully. Mm. We'll see if... Uh... You know, the great big guy in the sky doesn't hate that character enough. Yeah. Uh, can I uh, look around for my shield? I don't know how long it's been or oh, how long yeah, we've that's, been walking. It's um, you're, yeah, you're like a whole day's journey away from being within anywhere near that at all. Maybe. Good thing we spent like a whole day waiting for you to get that fucking shield. Shit. <laughs> are they are they still in Musiv? Who? No, they're like an hour from South of they are an hour from south. I thought no, no, no. They're heading oh, for a small to town, the right? Uh, called Carmiel. You get it. oh, it's right. traveling for eight hours. That's me. Yeah, and they're almost there. <laughs> okay. Yeah. What counts, me? Is, and Carmiel is in Musiv, or Carmiel is in Carmiel is not even on the map, but it is a small, uh, a small fishing village, on the south, yeah, western <laughs> side of Musiv. Okay. Uh, can I still look around for my shield? <laughs> Southwestern. <laughs> Just doesn't answer question. <laughs> Southwestern. Southwestern. Yeah. West? Cool. East? Yeah. Sorry, sorry. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> he pointed it, and I just went on the other time. They, like, they pointed east every time. Thank you. Uh, did you guys have a question? Can I, can I uh, still look around for my shield? <laughs> sure, man. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's do... I would like to think I, I have been doing this for the entirety of the Okay, time, but... let's roll four times, and they're all investigation rolls. Man! <laughs> okay, so the first one was an 18. <laughs> Alright. Uh, and my investigation is... Uh, let me pull up oh, my God. character card from D&D. &D Why none. have you not printed this? Because, I'm D &D. sorry, I've been really busy. I'm sorry. So okay. frustrated. Uh, investigation. Okay, that's bad. So 17. Oh, uh, three. Yeah. Uh, uh, non-natural one. And a sixteen. Too good, too bad. All right. Um, two times you odds. saw movement in the sand, and your instinct was to bury your head uh. in it. Okay. And you got nothing from those. It was just embarrassing, and everyone laughed at you. Okay. Uh, and then two of the times you did find something. First time was a shiny rock. So it looks okay. like a rock on most of it, except on one side it's like it's broken open and it seems to like glitter kind of silvery. 
Okay, shiny silvery rock. Yeah. Uh, did I notice any sort of magicalness behind it? No, it's a rock. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and uh, and then the last time you did find uh, a, a a plank of wood. Okay. Wood and rock. Got yes. it. <laughs> Got it. Thank you, DM. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> That's what you get for asking stupid questions, <laughs> doing stupid things. I know. <laughs> That He's writing this in his inventory, just so everyone knows. I, I would like He's one like, additional thing, um, yeah. uh, and I'm sorry I'm not trying to usurp the session, uh, but I would like to uh, have been finding and have found uh, some food for my small pet crab that I now own. Oh, that's right. You have that. <laughs> um, I'm going to say over the journey, the eight hours, the only thing that you have spotted and caught was another small crab. <laughs> Can I turn over to Colin and be like, hey, Colin, I will trade you a small crab for some food for a small crab that's different than the small crab I want to trade. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, we don't go and sold all of our supply in town <clears throat> Scotland. Yeah, but do you just have like a, a bit of bread? I don't think crabs eat. Can I fuck? It. Can you not tell me how to raise my crab? Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll, all right. Well, wait. So I get a I get a live little crab in yes. exchange for a, a piece of bread. Yes. Well, I, I think that's I think that's a deal ten times out of ten. Okay. Uh, so I'd like to uh, take his small piece of bread that okay. he gives me yeah, for this. Trade. Um, and I would like to just break off uh, oh, a hunk. Yeah. Bread. Okay. Yeah, I just like to break <laughs> off some of it and okay. um, put it in my in with my crab and kind of pet the top of my crab's head. Okay. Um, in hopes that he will. Ooh, let's do an animal handling roll. Okay. See if it likes you more. It doesn't like you currently. Just well, clarify. I mean, that's, true. <laughs> that's not surprising. Uh, I just really fucked up. Sorry. Um, I need to figure out something better. Like for printing what it I'm out. Doing. Yeah, like printing yeah. it out. <clears throat> What's my fucking animal hand? Oh, I have a plus one to animal hand because Ong is kind. I got a four. <laughs> you take two damage as it clamps your finger. That is okay. Uh, I still have 48 health points. Yeah, right. Uh, would anyone else like to do anything over this eight-hour journey? Apparently we can go back in time and redo things. Yeah, I want to make a um, this little crab. I'm going to mend him a little tiny top hat. Like a, no, like a visor because of the yeah. sun. Ooh. Would you like to hang on to my crab, Jolie, as you, uh, or, yeah, Jolie, as you seem to uh, be uh, a little bit better with uh, animals than me? He has great crabs. Yeah, sure. I'll hold on to him, and then when we get to this uh, little town, I'll set him free. Okay. Maybe he'll meet some, some city crabs. But <laughs> if, if you also want to keep him, keep him as a pet uh, <laughs> so I can pet him sometimes, I would understand that as well. <laughs> well, uh, well, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Okay. Uh, and then I give him a cute little a little visor. <laughs> I mend it. Wow. Does it look like a little tiny bonnet? <laughs> yeah, you know what? Fuck a visor. I made it a fucking bonnet. You're right. I change it up again. I change it up again. Y'all are so creative. Look at and then I give it. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, that crab went from like the women's tennis champion of the year. To a bonnet, well, first I made it a top hat, and then it was a visor, and yeah. now it's a bonnet. All right. Very home it's a bonnet crustacean. Yeah, this <laughs> reminds me of walking the Mormon Trail <laughs> when I was 14 at Girls Camp. <laughs> oh, that. Okay. <laughs> this is a real story. Did you die of dysentery? <laughs> nope, just rolled my ankle. <laughs> <laughs> and then walked on it for four days. Uh, can the four of you make a perception check? Um, sure. 17. What was that? 17. Uh, 17. Wow. Oh, jinx. Twinners. Do we drink on Drink. <laughs> drink on Need a rule. That's a lot roll. of drinking. Well, 20, 20 guys. Woo. You got a 20? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What did you get? 17. Just lie about it. Say something. Non natural what? 20. Perception roll? Oh, mm. perception check. Oh, my God. Sorry. Uh, Non-natural 20. I see everything. I got a 16. <laughs> well, you guys all, at the, except you see it milliseconds earlier, uh, like a, a uh, these, like, 
six ravens are just flying around in a circle just over this hill to your right. Um, do, um, what do I, how do I feel about it? Do I know that that occasionally is like a sign of like something dead? Yeah, I think that's pretty international. Jumping off the cart, running over there. Whoa, straight up. Going with her. Okay. <laughs> I don't say anything. Uh, I'm just like. You're just running. I'm just going to like, oh, I'll, be, I'll be right back. I'm going to check out something. See you okay. guys in a second. You fall into a trap. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you go, be like, there are spikes at the bottom. <laughs> you have to what? nat 20 to not die. Um, cool. You run over this. Oh, is anyone else going? Yeah, I'm going. Tax very confused. <laughs> Like, 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 ah, don't leave me with these people that have bad oatmeal. Yeah. <laughs> he's, like, <laughs> he's like, well, howdy, partner. <laughs> he has crap. You want to play, play a game? <laughs> he's going on a little tricycle. <laughs> How fast is the caravan moving forward? If we pretty. ditch it, will we, like, will they be gone? Uh, it's pretty slow. Okay. Yeah, you... yeah, fuck it, I'm bored. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's like 20, you know, carts and things, so they're not moving real fast. Um, Alright, so everyone's going, it sounds like? Yeah. Um, Alright, so you guys get over this hill, and you look down, and you see a bunch of birds flying, right, but then on the ground, a bunch of birds on the ground, and they're like nipping at this body. You can tell there's a corpse at the bottom. Run, I'm gonna run over to Whoa, whoa, whoa! Yes. <laughs> she is just an athlete today. Dude. <laughs> I got a full rest, bud. Yes. She did a couple lines before the session. A couple lines of desert sand. <laughs> You'll get you there. Magic sand. Yeah, magic um, sand. Okay, yeah, I mean, you head down to this thing. Um, it seems like a corpse of a body. <laughs> What? <laughs> Unless you'd like to inspect it. <laughs> yeah. So the corpse of a car? Is that a, cute, a person? A... Yeah, um, so they're wearing a, uh, it's like a, a black, I don't want to say robe, but like a black long outfit. <laughs> um, and it has uh, like a like a captain's hat. Cool. Oh, Austin, oh. you son of a bitch, I would have not paid that debt. <laughs> it's not a goblin. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Thank God. Yeah, it's a human. No goblin captains. <laughs> Tag just goes, what? what? <laughs> not, you, not you, Tag. I owe money to a dead guy. And then I pull out like my spear and I kind of like go up to him and like poke him a little bit. Oh yeah, <laughs> like super, you're poking a dead body. Yeah. Yeah. Like, the kid thing to do. Yeah. Tag goes, rifle through his pockets. Well, <laughs> duh. I just gotta make sure he's dead first. He's not gonna jump up and stab me. Fair. Yeah. Fuck's sake. <laughs> what did you unplug? What do you keep touching on? This is fun. Is everything okay? Nothing. Nothing wrong. <laughs> I mean, something got unplugged, is but... all your dice? Okay, good. No, it was my phone. Oh, all right. My yeah. dice are here. Thank God. I guess whatever it was okay, so. couldn't have been I don't want you to move anything else. <laughs> you know, I trust you. Sorry about that. We thought we unplugged uh, some things that might have been important. <laughs> Nothing happened. Um, this is my life support. Yeah, I want to investigate this body. Yeah, man. Um, so you're going to search, like, his pockets and stuff? Oh, yeah. I'm going to steal so everything. You're gonna so you're going to touch him. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> You always fuck with me oh, all man. the time. I yeah. hate it. Oh, it's because you're always concerned. Because okay. you literally, you love murdering me. Um, right. Something broken, Sam? No. It's all good. right, great. Yeah. So uh, you poke this thing, and then you investigate him, and uh, you find uh, about 50 gold. Um, <laughs> and then you also find a little, like, chipped scimitar. Like a medium-sized scimitar. Don't okay. do it. And <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> never touch the scimitar. Um, Don't touch a dead man's scimitar. And then scimitar. you feel like something like cold and like hard, like metal, something underneath his shirt when you pass. Him. I just go. <laughs> I'm just like. Okay, that's metal. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. I'm like, hmm. Well. 
see what this is. <laughs> okay. So you, you, you can see this chain around his neck, and you start to like pull that out, and it's a necklace. And the end of this necklace is uh, a little emblem, and it has an S, and um, you can see like a human tooth going through the center of it. Ty, I think that's so sick. Yeah. In game and out of game, I want that. <laughs> yup. Does it have puka shells on it? Uh, it is a puka shell necklace. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you know, a puka <laughs> shell necklace. Know. All right, fuck. Metal. Let's go. <laughs> just put this. I'm gonna. I'm gonna put it on. Your hair yeah, becomes frosted. Right. I'm just. I'm. I'm all into fucking. Is it, okay? What is, is it? A gold chain or puka shells? Some puka shell, some what? <laughs> half puka, is half puka. Like the skinny ones that make like a rope, or like a like oh. football, football. Yeah, yeah, it has like pink beads that connect it. Mm-hmm. Puka shell, all right. Puka shell, pink um, beads. Okay. <laughs> I'm putting that shit on. Fuck it. Yeah. Let's do it. I look dope. Yeah, Actually, you look, I like, like you look fly. I look sly. I like. <laughs> I'm like. Nice. Mm. Hey, you guys think this guy's a dead pirate captain? What does his hat look like? Uh, I guess I'm there. So hat. <laughs> Let me wipe this sand out of my eyes. <laughs> Man, everyone does, everyone has bad eyesight. You and all. Uh, could I could I go up and uh, just kind of poke his body a little bit too, real quick? Yeah, sure. Uh, I just like to give him one good poke. Just a fucking poke. With what? Just my <laughs> finger. Oh yeah. You poke him and it's like gross dead body that's been there for like four weeks. Can, do I know uh, like the origins of nice. this individual? Oh man, he certainly like seems piratey to you. Uh, do I recognize the clan of pirate? Um, yeah, well you know that <laughs> some pirates have like a, a permanent tattoo on their lower back. Like a tram stamp. Black like air dress. Yeah. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's some, so many some secrets. people. Oh, another one of the clans uh, has a piercing in a very particular place, and then there's also another clan that's Prince kind of Albert. a newer clan um, that oh. does like a necklace. Prince yeah. Albert. So this is either a Prince Albert clan, a Slinter clan, <laughs> or a, a, a trap, ta- uh, tra- tramp stamp clan <laughs> pirate. I've seen all of them. <laughs> hey, do you know what this is? is uh, it, or is it just cool? That's a puka shell necklace. <laughs> no, 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 the emblem. Oh, uh, do I know what it is? Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's actually, so the Slinter Clan has uh, a couple of different emblems depending on where, like, they, where they call home, where their port is, and uh, that's one of them. They're a bunch of fucking assholes. This one time I was on a Slinter ship, and, uh... Sounds made up. No, it's not. They <laughs> fucking, uh, they came through uh, one of the ports I was staying at. They just came in, and they, they didn't even do anything mean. They just kind of shit in the floor in a couple of different taverns <laughs> and then left. I, I, I don't know that I understand exactly why they do things <laughs> like that, but they just seem to terrorize local <laughs> populaces. Anyway, Tech, does this look cool? It looks amazing. I, mean, I can't lie. Every week. It's sick. Yeah, uh, you have plus one charisma rolls to pirates. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You bet nice. I do. <laughs> you bet I do. That's sick. <laughs> that counts. Does that count against Om? <laughs> yes. <laughs> as long as you identify as a pirate. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think so. I think that's, that's great. They're also. I'm so stoked. I've got a puka shell necklace and a gold tooth. Sick. Just to let you know, they're also <laughs> responsible for international meat distribution. Wait, what? The the Slinter Pirates they they distribute meat. So I, I just wanted to tell you that. <laughs> like, and they shit they shit all, all over the place. Is just that what so, you said? yeah, yeah the other is like big meat poops. So yeah, they'll like, shit on meat. like the floor or like de pants people when they come into ports, or they'll fucking come on through and just like. Kind of, kind of slap a bunch of people and then run away. Some <laughs> sometimes they do real fucked up shit, but I haven't seen any of it in person. I, I I've heard of some real fucked up shit, but really all I've seen is them just being a bunch of assholes and then running away. This is great. Well, sounds I'm like we should go um, clan. We should go uh, in disguise with these and just go uh, with those pirates and just go around a town and pretend to be them one day and just slap people and take shits everywhere. It kind of sounds fun. Yeah, I mean I. I don't 
I, I can get away with the lingo. I know, like, port and starboard and all that shit. So. <laughs> all right, well, guess we better... Take its clothes! I, I figured you guys were going to do that. Yeah, I mean, he's a dead uh, body. He doesn't need his pirate clothes anymore. He attacks our time dressing him. Can I have the hat at least? Do you do it centrally? Wait, I'm sorry. Bam, bam, I'm just still bam, laughing by his bam, whole thing. Um, <laughs> yeah, you take the clothes off him. What's your... Darn wow. hat. Yeah, man. They're yours. Does he you have, have a cool pirate so, hat? Is it, it, pirate it, is it the piercing or the tattoo? Here's <laughs> <laughs> the neck wish. <laughs> um, does he have a pirate hat? Yeah, well, he took it's it. It's in my bag. Yeah. Well, um, that's cool. Um, but can I have no. that? The hat at least? We'll see. I didn't get to keep my last hat. How about I'll I'm so salty about it. How about I'll give you 50, 50 gold coins for that hat? It's a hat. We can co-parent the hat. Can oh, that's today? precious. Yeah. Can I have it today? Come yes. on, I want to look pretty. Yes. yes. Sick. Hey, will you hand me that hat? Oh, How does that work? Are there rules to co-parent? Is there a power hat? Oh, oh yeah. close. That'll, that'll, that'll work. It's now. That'll do. <laughs> that'll do. That'll do. <laughs> Sweet. I think I'd be a good pirate, don't you think, Ong? Uh, as long as you're down to do some pillaging, uh, I think <laughs> you wouldn't be too bad. Oh, I'm already great at pillaging. Good. Uh, then yes, uh, all you need to do is learn a couple sea shanties, enjoy gurgling uh, rum, and yep, yep. Uh, learn how to raise a mast and say ahoy in at least ten different dialects. How about this one? Ahoy! Teach us a chanty! Teach us a chanty! Right now! Right now! <laughs> There's only one time where you can't drink whiskey. It's not right now, so let's drink some whiskey. Mmm, whiskey. Mmm, mmm, whiskey. Yeah. I wanted to find music for you so bad. <laughs> no, it's okay. It, we can't wait for that. There's no music behind shanties. Yeah. We'll practice our harmonies later. Just because it gets. I'll, I'll teach you guys a like the most zen, like pirate music. Yeah, I'll ever. teach you guys another one. <laughs> Year of the start, camel. I'm gonna start walking back to where the caravan line is. Yeah, me I'm too. I'm just gonna play this track. Now. I feel like I've heard this while getting a massage. <laughs> 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 Royalty free, uh, man. Let's go. Um, yeah, right. I'm like walking and like whistling the, the shanty. Tack wants to check his mouth for any like gold or silver teeth. The guy's mouth. Yeah. His own mouth? The guy's mouth. Yeah, that's actually what the I dead thought. Dead man. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, you find like three wooden teeth. I don't keep them. <laughs> okay. Not today. He's, he's, he's like, hmm, up. oatmeal. And then, <laughs> <laughs> is this oatmeal? Ew. <laughs> <laughs> We're all back. Okay, right. All right, so you guys, uh, you, you hear them, like, calling from the caravan, right? Mm -hmm. uh, you just hear, like, Colin's voice in the distance. Hey, you guys! We're about to leave. Did you say, like, Hey, you guys. Yes. I wanted to do him doing that quote hey, you from guys. his voice. <laughs> um, I pick up my pace and go faster. Yeah, okay, y'all headed and back. I kick the back of Jolie's we're leg as we're going to try and trip her. What? Damn. <laughs> You're on something to <laughs> Like, just the kick, like, the back. Just like the casual friendly trip. <laughs> oh, like, underneath okay. the foot? Like, yeah. Make it, I'll race make you back it to the caravan roll. tag. <laughs> oh my god. Just do it. your dex. <laughs> 22! <laughs> Nat 20! What's oh! Alright, so Miranda, you, you're also tripping her? What? No, he's tripping I'm, I'm Jolene. tripping Jolene. Oh, I thought we were, okay, I thought it was the target. She contested yeah. I was like, damn, role. what's the deal? Um, yeah, man. <laughs> he's trying to, do I trip? <laughs> um, yeah, so, that's a confusing conundrum. I feel like that the 22 still wins. <laughs> Over a now. Oh, you got the 22? Uh, it's 17 plus 5. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, what's, uh, what's... I mean, I did roll in that. 20. Yeah, I just, I feel... Mm. Okay, so you go to trip her. <laughs> this is like intense music for this. <laughs> it's an intense <laughs> moment. 
Wait until the wait until to determine the attack makes it to the caravan or not. I don't know what I just played, but this is what it is. Uh, okay. it's, the ocean. it's more okay. massage music. <laughs> Uh, you go to trip her, and uh, she dodges it. Mm -hmm. She um, dies. By, like, she like sees it, like lifts up her <laughs> leg, and then you like kind of stumble forward because you're unprepared. You like sink into sand a little bit, and then she is she's like hopping back, is like like off balance, and then falls on her butt. And now you're basically she's on the ground, and you're like up to sand up to your waist. Oh no way! I know what I did wasn't cool, but. <laughs> I'd like to just go Someone pick throw them. me row. I'd just like to go pick them both up and just yank uh, Tack out of the sand and just kind of toss them towards the uh, caravan. Okay. Wait, I can't hear you. Oh, sorry. I'm, uh, oh, picking, I'm picking you up and tossing you towards the caravan. Woo! In, in the fun way. The fun mm -hmm. kind of toss. We high five oh, yeah, in midair. Sure. Yeah. Hey, it's a <laughs> Alrighty. Um... Yeah. Song. <laughs> on fixes that issue. Uh, and you guys make it back to the caravan. Perfect. And we're gonna switch perspective. Yay. Bum, bum, bum. You're the pirate. <laughs> you look so morbid with this. <laughs> you look like a little think, pilgrim. I man. think you think Amish. Yeah. No, you, look, you mean Amish? You look like a little pilgrim. I need, I need a, I need a little like one of those kinds of ears. You should pick up the cool braids. Toku. You and Air just stare down at your lifeless, cold corpse on the ground, full of horror. Air just is still holding the neck of a wild camel and slowly loses his grip on the animal. <laughs> I forgot! <laughs> Caught in a fierce stare at what you both are looking at. Um, I think, uh, I think we should take this with us. Yeah, hundred percent agree. Um, um, but where are we going? There's a, there's someone back in Sculling that I think can analyze both you and this corpse. Who? Well, um, it's the, it's the guy that I got my kick-ass wings from. There's Yo, a, is this that? That gnome you guys are talking about? There, there's a gnome tinker, and while we were there, he he put Tack into a into a giant vat of liquid and did some tests on him. And I feel like you'd be the perfect person to to take you and whoever or whatever this is. I feel like that's the best option we got. Um, yeah, let, let, let's go for it. Um, I want to try to uh, like. Tame the the near the camel that I'm close to. Um, uh, my camel, can. bro. <laughs> yeah, well, the camel that you were holding on to. Yeah, that yeah. I was. Yeah. Oh, the dead one? No, no, no. There, there were three camels. <laughs> oh, you went and chased after the second one. That's yeah. right. Well, the, the, he was yeah, gonna this, this is the one that started to eat. No, me. he murdered the first this one. This is one that was eating your dead body. His ass. <laughs> yeah. In an attempt to find my son. You need to change your alignment, dog. That that's not. <laughs> that was a thousand percent not a like, anti-neutral good move. Holy crap. What a sentence. Don't... I was, <laughs> dude, I literally just... I can't. I just looked at him and I, I was like... I'm neutral good, and it totally didn't, like... Violate that. Would, that. Yeah. Right. Yeah, that's it what didn't, I'm It didn't violate it? Yeah, in any way. Like if we you, can talk about this later, but it's fine. No, we'll talk it, about the ethics of murdering innocent animals. Uh, <laughs> like, first off... <laughs> the animal. Okay, here's the thing. Oh my god. All right, let's break this down. Hold on. No, no, hold on, let's, hold on. no, no, no. let's go ahead and talk about no, it. No, I want to talk about it. I just yeah. want to make sure that when we talk about order it. Order in the court. It's really a, fun. <laughs> Did you just say order in the court? <laughs> order in the court. You would be the judge. So. Okay, wait. All right, go ahead. All right. So, here's the thing. Um, if Steve's my son, Correct. and he's sentient, and I have evidence. Uh, that would lead me to believe that perhaps a camel killed him, then in vengeance, it's okay to attack a camel. But you didn't have okay, evidence, so right? Okay, so here's a counter. Other than he was here's missing, a... and I already know that the camels have been eating other things. And it was heat of the moment. And it was yeah. heat of the moment. Mm -hmm. And sure. you guys don't know this, but Eridris well, has a whole backstory yeah. that 
would Warm encourage. Yeah, yeah, Dad. No. It's, I think I think the only one that knows anything uh, about it is Toby. Brut brutally mutilated wife by demons, ah, and then dead wife, uh, and kidnapped daughter. Dead wife. So. Dead daughter. Oh my god. I think the only one that yes. heard, has heard any of this was Togu and Erdersing. Well, I think I think since now, I mean, we just had to throw this out there. So the ethics, okay. Of so I get why you did it. Right. But also, the camel did not maliciously potentially murder a snake. Also, camels don't eat meat. So, uh, but I think your response was not. At, it wasn't a like normal thing for you to kill an innocent animal, but shit happens. But well, yeah, for one, story, yeah. for one, it's not like uh, how there, there's no way of knowing within the context of whether or not it's an innocent animal. We've been killing animals this whole time. <laughs> like this is the first Mon time. Monsters, monsters. Well, but but what's the difference between a monster and an animal? Your buddy tried to stop me from I feel like way out of the this is a long, evil, long uh, distraction. Yeah, Sounds but like how long how can you dictate like when you're looking at an animal like discern its alignment? Green sand, green sand, evil. <laughs> Alrighty, <laughs> moving on. <laughs> Jeez. So. You guys can you cut that out. <laughs> so We're live. I think yeah. that was like eight minutes straight. Yeah, no, um, it, was, it was a good tangent. Quick cutaway. Quick cutaway. That was great. Yeah, Comment Sidebar. down below if you think that Adrian yeah. is a vicious Ooh. animal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. That's yeah let's, uh, cool. Did he do the right thing? Did he do yeah, the wrong thing? Yeah, uh, so if, if you guys is he going to murder saw him? your kids uh, killed eaten. by an animal, or you were led to believe that maybe your kids were killed by an animal, would you seek to maybe kill that animal to try to confirm? He's also not your actual kid. Uh, oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't know that. You, oh my god. <laughs> we can already... Move can we move forward? <laughs> the music has changed. <laughs> no, well, I mean... Sage has been I'm sent. still upset about this because I tried to stop it. Uh, well, which, which is fine I because <laughs> I... So here's the thing. Again, Eridris' backstory. On top of that. No, we're, we're fucking talking about it now, right, guys? Speak your truth. Let's go. And and then on top of that. music on now. Do you guys do you guys remember do you guys remember the stuff that Austin was speaking into my brain? Yes. Right. If, that's if, if it, some seriously dark shit. If it's any consolation, I think you are more than justified. Thank you. Just, thank you. Yeah. I, 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 Ong, I, Ong has punched people for less. Yes. And took off penises. <laughs> oh, whatever. That's also true. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> and we're back. Yes. Okay. Boats. Comment down below if you're like stoked on animal cruelty. I'm not. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm totally kidding. I'm out. This is, this is God damn it! Uh, I'm just gonna make you wild in the desert. This I'm totally that's, kidding. That's fine. No, but you got a camel. We're good. Okay, two camels. Fuck that camel. <laughs> All right, and we're back. Are we? I don't know. All right, so. Yes, you're retaining him. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm getting my fucking mount. Let's do animal handling. Please don't. Hey, that is a. That's on the ground. That's a, that's an unnatural twenty. Ooh, dude, nice. Okay, yeah, that camel is your bud. Cool. Even though he just more than just killed his friend. Yeah, but fear he. Eridris is a survivalist that's been. <laughs> He's done. Eridris has been killing a lot of animals. Is that I don't. This is so stupid that I have to explain Eridris's entire backstory. No, you don't have to. Explain and, that one. No, apparently I do because everybody thinks like animal cruelty is a thing. No, that, I'm off hundred percent joking. God damn it! Fuck this shit. All right. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Remember. Cool. All right. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna look. Toby's gonna look at Ayers and say, um, "So I, I, I I've put, got. Let's I, load him up on my camel. It's already sit down here and mellow. If you're cool with that, uh, or do you want to hold him? Well, I mean, this this camel's pretty fucking mellow. But okay, it's whatever. I mean, I, two I, of I, me. I just, I just pick. I just pick it up and I put it on the camel's hump and okay. then mount up. Uh, but I'm gonna stop you because I want him on my camel because it's you, me. You want you want your you want your okay. Yeah. 
That's yeah, fine. especially because I'm a gnome and he's a gnome and you're a normal sized human, so I don't want your camel to get too tired. Thank you for. Okay, well then you can take. Yeah. Thanks. Yourself. Would you help me load him up? Because I'm. Yes. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna toss. I'm gonna toss the other togu on the back of hmm. the current togu, and then I'm gonna hop on my camel. Okay. Um. And so I'm, gonna, I'm gonna hop on my camel, and I'm gonna go like hop hop. And I just kind of stand up. Yeah, the camel does this weird like stand. Yeah. I like sound effects, and I'm gonna get ready to go, and I'm just gonna look at the air, and just be like. Yeah, which way is uh, Skull? Um, do do we have any bearing on our current like position mm. based upon like where we were flying with the thing? We can probably see the, the mountain, right, the or the, the dune where the hive was, yep. right? Yeah, you could probably deduce it from that. Okay. Suns. Okay, I think that's fair. Um, well, sweet. Well, yeah, and then with the sun, yeah, yeah. Uh, I feel good about these two strapping heroes accomplishing that. I'm I'm pretty sure it's that way. <laughs> Let's go north. <laughs> Best way to put it. Let's ride off. Yeah. And I would like to start riding off in a medium pace because it's hot out. Okay. okay. A trot. <laughs> yeah. Just an easy camel's trot. Just a little. It's pace. a show camel. <laughs> so you guys start. Yeah. <laughs> you guys start riding off uh, into you know the the, the desert sands. Um, it's just like a mirage at the end, right? It just seems infinite. And, um, Togu, you're staring into the distance, and as the, the where the sky hits the ground, the colors almost become one, and it starts to blur, and it starts to become one color, and you're kind of confused, and you are just almost like falling asleep, and Eric just, you see him, like this medium-paced camel, <laughs> just starting to waver, and like his head's going back. And, um, just like, well, let me change that first. That's not what I wanted. Okay. Um, as your head wavers, you fall backwards, and you just feel the slam. And everything is black for a second. And you start to have this headache. And it's like this gate in front of you. Um, and the gate is stone. And it has, um, it's like everything else is black around you, endless black. What would you like to do? Uh, walk to the stone gate. <laughs> is that going to make one option for you? <laughs> You're like, I fucking leave. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to turn around, he's like, and then you start falling. Like, Fuck! <laughs> Again! Um, yeah, yeah. I'd like to walk up to the gate and, uh, yeah, look at it and stuff. Okay. Um, yeah, you're looking at it, um, and there seems to be some bright light coming from the keyhole. I'm gonna peep it. Peep okay. It. Yeah, you start to look, and you get this raging headache, um, as you're looking through this, and it's like the light is so bright, you know, almost like hangover, you know, it's just any light, and it's just like an explosion of a headache. Uh, I'd like to inspect the keyhole without looking in it. See if I okay. recognize the shape or whatever. Yeah. Um, hmm. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, it seems like a keyhole. <laughs> wow. Sweet, man. Do I still have the key on me? I don't think I do. Mm. Is there a, a, a handle or anything? Or is it literally yeah, just a hole? There's a handle. I'm gonna twist it, see if it's open. Okay, you touch it and you just hear a voice. Um, <laughs> are you sure you want to open this? Who's there? You're nothing. Cool. Uh, <laughs> is it? It's literally just like a freestanding gate, right? Yeah. I think comically, I just want to like peek around it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you do, and there's nothing. It's just black this. I'm gonna grab the handle again. Yeah. Uh, this is yours to open, if you want. I'm gonna open it. Okay. Um, this headache as you turn the handle just is like splitting, um, and you open it through, and for a, a split second, it's like Nirvana in your head. Down. Um, it's like. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> 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 
Um, there you go. And you, uh, um, and you just hit like this this tranquil place um, in your brain, and it's like you've opened something up in your head. It's like you've um, remembered something that you forgot. Uh, is it something happy, sad, nothing? You how, see, do, how do I feel remembering this? You see it, yeah, this is, you, you, basically you see a vision. Um, you remember suddenly that you used to have a best friend back when you were young. He's <laughs> very smiling over A best friend uh, around the age of six or so. And for a year since you'd met, you guys were inseparable. And this best friend was named Jeffrey. He's not celebrating anymore. <laughs> no, I thought it was somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> I actually didn't know what you were celebrating. I was like, how does he know? No, nah, last session. Never mind. All right. So, uh, <laughs> and you and Jeffrey were running around as kids, uh, you know, the best of friends, just having fun in town. Um, and right when you're about to get back home, you're a couple streets away with your best friend, Jeffrey. Um, a couple bullies that were a few years. <laughs> it's gone. A few years, a few years older than you. Um, started to bully you guys and then you just have this memory of, of feeling overwhelmed and running away and when you got home uh, your father scolded you for after you told him what you did uh, for abandoning your friend and he said you remember him saying this I was going to give you the family knife but maybe you don't deserve it and you come out of this vision and you're laying on your body you see your face like you've just been riding this camel like hopping on your own face um, and then uh, you look up and see you're holding the stagger. Hey, uh, Aaron, just can T we take a break took for a second? Are you, uh, are you okay? I saw you. Uh, I saw you kind of like. No, like, I, th I think not I, off. I, I just I just need a second. That's cool. I'd like to get right. my camel to sit down and. All right. Yeah. Let's yeah. take a break. Um, sure. Yeah. I'm gonna go for a walk. Are you okay for a second? Yeah, and Did I, you watch, I, I guess, me? I, I, I look around and I'm like, Did just a walk? Yeah, I, just, I mean, I just need a second by myself. Okay. Um, and then I'd like to keep my, keep the Jessica dagger or the church key hidden until I'm away from him and then I want to inspect it when I'm a good distance with my back to Eridus. Okay. So he can't see me inspecting them. Yeah. Um... You're kind of trying to hide that from him right now. Mm -hmm. So let's do a performance. Hell yeah, we are. And you can do perception. Uh, it would be easy to do. Or you got four. It, really insight, I'm sorry. Insight. Oh, ins insight? Yeah. Well, insight's so a six. I got a 14. Six total? Yeah. Okay, yeah, you're convinced he's, like, the first time you've ever seen him so sad. All right. <laughs> All right, so you... <laughs> Yeah. Um, so you start to walk away um, and you inspect this. Um, what kind of, I mean, what, you want to investigate it? You I'm trying to, to see first off, I think first idea is to see if anything is different or... Okay. I, I, it's twofold. I think at first I want to appreciate it because it's a family dagger and I yeah. know it and it's really important that I've got it. And then I want to inspect it to see if it is the actual same dagger. Okay. Um, yeah. So let's let's roll an investigation then. Um, and is this a magical item or technical item? Is that like a skill of yours? Yeah. Mm -hmm. To do what with it? I forget. I double. Double. <laughs> it sucks. We have to tell you. Yes. <laughs> what was it? The two? Yeah. I rolled a... rolled a four then? Uh, no, I rolled a, a nine. Oh, word, okay. Um, yeah, it seems pretty, uh, genuine article. Okay. Uh, I want to fill out sharp it is. Okay, yeah, you touch it and it, it feels, uh, fairly sharp, but hasn't been used in a while. Okay. Um, but it, like, started to cut you and you stopped towards the tip. Okay. Uh, did it actually cut me? No. Can I? Yeah. Just a little bit on the finger. Yeah, it cuts. Yeah. Ow! <laughs> well, I guess... <laughs> did, I, did I hear that? Did I hear him say ow? Um, yeah, yeah, roll perception, I guess. 
seven. <laughs> oh man, I feel like it's a pretty low DC. It, you did fine. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. To to Togu, are you are you okay? What happened? What happened? Um, I'm gonna walk back to Airdress. I uh, so I lost Swivel in my tumble. Yeah. Um, but I I, I found this. Oh. I'd like to show it to him. I'm not gonna give it to him. I'm gonna hold it. That's really cool. Um, yeah, it is also the uh, Jessica family dagger. This is a uh, church key. How, how did you get that going down a hill? Um, I, I think I earned it. Huh. Is, is it? Is that why you haven't been feeling good? I, I don't know. Um, have we looked at the other Togu yet? Have we? I mean, what do you mean? I would like to inspect the Togu body okay. for old items, i.e. like swivel and whatever. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, I, you search through the body on the back of the camel and, um, yeah, you just find like some of your clothes that you're currently wearing is on the mm -hmm. same body, um, and uh, it's I mean it's a little messed up, but it, it's the same same clothes, and then that's pretty much it. Okay. Um. Yeah, I. My head is just killing me. I'm sorry. Um. um well, I was uh, I was kind of saving this for a special occasion, I guess. Um, but, uh, I know, I know you've been through a lot, and, uh, here you go. Um, and I pull out, uh, the, the two bottles of black liquid that I found underneath his mattress. Mm. And I give them to Togo. It's like, here, um, I don't know what these are, but I think you might like them. Wait, where, where did you get those? It's a oh, long, sorry. it's a long story. Are those the ones from, from my bed? Yeah. Yeah. Um. I must smell it. Yeah. It says, I mean, like the most beautiful aroma you've ever smelled. Here. Doing cheers or something? Cool. First taste is yours, thank you. Can, can, can I smell it a little bit? <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm super suspicious. What is, what is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is this? Like, wait, wait, like, this is like your really room. nice stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. So, okay. Um, uh, uh, can I? Uh, yeah. Can I do an insight check on on Togu just to like determine whether or not this is like a good thing that he's sure offering? Yeah. Um, that's a unnatural twenty. Oh yeah. I mean, yeah, he's like, cool. he, he, you genuinely believe that he thinks this is incredible. Oh, thank you. Um, I, and I, I take a, I take a sip. Okay. Yeah, um, so you, I mean, you're just hit with all of these, like, deep, like, oak smells. Um, and just this really beautiful kind of hint of, of lemon. I want to grab it from the, like, to taste the lemon. <laughs> yeah, it that. comes through really nicely. That's... And then Togu does like a, like the super obnoxious like. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's horrible. Um, that other bottle bottle is is yours if you'd like it. Well, how about I just hold on to it? There's no reason. It 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 might be kind of a a long journey back to Sculling and. You know, now that I think about it, maybe we shouldn't be drinking al alcohol out in the middle of the desert. But <laughs> no, that's a great call. I want to take, uh, I want to take one more swig, <laughs> and then I'll hand it back to him. Okay. Um, no, th thanks. That means a lot. And I know I give you a hard time a little bit, and we kind of had a little puff our chest moments with over the camel and stuff. But I just want to say, like, you know, I, I appreciate you, man. I really do. Thanks, Toby. You're welcome. I appreciate that. Um... And the whole dead uh, Togu body, just so that you know, yeah. I might be like cool outside. I am freaking the fuck out inside. Um, I understand, man. 
So, well, let's, let's go uh, see. Uh, let's go get to that known tinker, I guess, huh? Yeah, let's see. Let's see if we can take care of that. Um. So, as you guys uh, finish talking, finish drinking, um, you guys can see about five uh, horses running across the desert. Um, not far from you. They just came around this dune. I would say maybe like. 50 feet away from you at this point. Wild horses or? Oh, uh, yes. There there are people on the horses. Oh. oh. Uh, Individuals. Can we sort. can we determine that this, uh, I just want to see if they're, like, they look trustworthy or they look like. Yeah. Um, they're not going incredibly fast, uh, like a medium trot. <laughs> okay. And uh, mm-hmm. you can tell that they're merchants. Like okay. 100%. Uh, oh. I want to, Erdress. Yeah, yeah. I have an idea. Um, an idea? Yeah, you, you ready to follow along? Well, well of it? course. I mean, we could just yell at him. I want to start screaming, Help! Help! My brother's dead! My brother is sick! We need help! We, we need help! We need help! Ah! <laughs> Come over here! We need, we need help! Yeah, um, you see one look, and then he points, and then a couple other ones, and you just hear, <laughs> and they just turn. And start coming towards oh, the riders that's, of Robo. That, that's that's the help. <laughs> that's the helper's whistle. Oh my god. That's the helper's whistle. He's my brother. Yeah. 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 Okay, okay, totally. Cool. Dude. Um, and there's only one way to tell you apart. It's your feet. <laughs> um. <laughs> okay, asshole. <laughs> that was funny. That was good. That was At good. least duck feet. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, Eric, is your head a cat? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. I forgot about my head's, that. My head's my head's still a cat. Oh my god. It's a blue <laughs> kitty cat. <laughs> you look like a were cat. It looks like Sully. <laughs> Sully. Like a really bad cosplay of Sully from Monster <laughs> <laughs> We're just Sully and fucking Mike. <laughs> um, so all the merchants uh, reach you guys, so and um, he so he's like, what, "What is wrong with you guys?" Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, oh, that's right. Um, don't don't worry about it. It's it's a whole thing. I had a weird run-in with a with a wizard. It's not a whole thing. It's like one part of a thing. I know. I I, I it, it's it's complicated to explain. I, I just I ran into this wizard entrepreneur um, in, a, <laughs> in a cave, and um, this is this is what happened. I, it, it, that's that's not what's important right now. We need we need help for. This is this is my uh, this is my brother, and and, and he just. He, he, I, I don't think he's gonna make it, and we need to get this going as soon as possible. Well, okay. Um, Do you guys uh, know where Sculling is or which direction we should be heading? Oh yeah, well, yeah, Sculling's it's it's north from here. It's the it's the way we're headed. Oh, you guys are headed that way as well. Well, we are, but it just depends on how fast you get to Sculling. It's it's about a two week travel. Two on, weeks from here? Smokes on camel. On camel. Um, what, what, I, about, uh, what about on horse? Well, you could maybe cut that down to eight days. Holy smoke! That's that's significantly. Is, is there another city that's closer? Well, there's. What you could do is you could go see the guru. The guru. The guru in the sky tower. Is it just the Zohan? <laughs> the, the love guru. Yeah. That's good too. Ooh, different direction, yeah. yeah. It's just Will Smith as Hitch. <laughs> <laughs> but just, when he's like having an allergic reaction, like that one. Um, yeah. um, is, is the this sky this? tower? What is, what's the sky tower? The tower's just 15 miles south of here. Uh, how big of a tower is it? And I, and I look to the south. Can I see the tower? <laughs> well, I'll see what's right there. Smart. Smart. <laughs> I got a, uh, rolled a 19. Mm. I didn't. <laughs> okay. Nope. You're short. You squint and squint. Like, immediately. Like, okay, wow. Right. You look out uh, <laughs> south from you guys, and you square for like a second. You see like a, a sliver in the sky for like a second. Oh, oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> how, how, how do you guys know this guru? Is he trustworthy? Everybody knows the guru. 
I don't know the guru. Do I know the guru? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Just kidding, I do know. Let's do a history check. Sweet. Uh, I give mean, advantage. Can, can, can we both just do you that? You can, you can too. But you can too. Um, I just got a four. Okay, your DC was a lot harder. <laughs> yeah. I did not have it. I, I didn't roll advantage on that. But no. Okay. Uh, thirteen. He's from here. That's why he is. Yeah. 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 I I figured as much. Okay. Right. Um. Unless I get to use Artificer's Lord, but I don't think I do. No. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, you've heard vaguely um, that there is some mysterious thing in the Deadlands, which is where you're at, and um, that there are some, like, kind of mysterious spiritual beings and wizards. Do I know the name of this guru, or it's just, he just, they just go as the guru? Uh, you don't know okay. him specifically. Okay. The guru. Um, but you have heard of the Sky Tower. Erges, I've heard of the Sky Tower before. This... Okay. Um, I, I, I'd say let's go. I don't. We don't have enough supplies to last two weeks on the sand, or even eight days. Yeah, that's 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 wise. It's wiser than I'm. Um, no. I want to look back at the merchant and ask him if they would lead us to the Sky God. Tower. <laughs> that's okay. Oh well, no, we're headed. We're headed to Skull and Wheat. We must go there. Um, well, a bottle of. Probably the finest whiskey I, I, you I'm can like, find. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> and I hand it to him. <laughs> like, the oh, I see going with this. Okay, yeah. Are either, are any of you from the area? Well, certainly. Have you all been to Scotland? I mean, we 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 traveled there fortnightly to sell our rugs. So you've probably been to Half Town, haven't you? Well. Everyone's had some interesting times in Half Town. <laughs> that they have. So if you've been to Half Town, you've been to the Empty Mug, of course. Well, where else is there to go? My name is Togu. I'm the owner of the Empty Mug. This is the aged Jessica family whiskey. There are two bottles. One unopened, and the other is open, but also right here. You lead us to the Sky Tower, the second bottle is yours. One of its kind. Togu of the Jessica family? That is not. If that's true, what is your family saying? My family saying? <laughs> <laughs> My family saying. Some people say the glass is half full. Others say the glass is half empty. The Jessicas will forever say, hey, you gonna finish that? <laughs> <laughs> but um, <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> Was I that just put you on the was spot. No, not even close. <laughs> oh, <laughs> uh, we didn't talk about having this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it, it's not an improv joke. Yeah. I, uh, <laughs> I took an old joke and flipped it. Well done. Very quick, too. That was good. Yeah. You fucking fucked that up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to lower the amount of positive reinforcement in this room. We're all so supportive. I'm like, it's such an intense. Meanwhile, we just shit on an air dress for like 20 minutes for killing for no a camel. Reason. And then everything Tugu says, everybody's like, wow. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, the merchant says, he's like, well. For one of the, the private reserve of, you know, the Jessica family, I think we'll take you there. Perfect. We'll tell you what, this empty, this full bottle is yours. And before we go, I could use a little bit of a drink. What about you? Yeah, I mean, as long as it's, I just look up the sun, it's like, it's, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have tea first. Then I, then I, uh, do I go swiggies? Yeah, swiggies. Pass it around. Yeah, uh, yeah, I mean, everyone's just killing this thing. I want to do the same thing, be like, yeah. taste the lemon. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, wow. I like, know, right? Oh, I know, right? <laughs> and lemongrass flavor. Yeah. It's, not, it's not lemongrass, it's real lemon. I mean, oh, it's okay. Sorry. Okay. I no, but just taste it. Taste the lemon. No, it, yeah. It's, it's awesome. I'm glad you like it. You're like, well, it's not citrus. It's, it's not citrus. It's <laughs> How? Uh, Erichus, how are you with uh, alcohol? Uh, like... It it came. <laughs> You're like I'm drinking. I, I don't know. Like, <laughs> this is this is not the first time that Eridris has drank alcohol. You, in it's like a, what are yeah. you wearing? 
I I am only wearing pants. I, I'm wearing speedy pants and that's all. I thought you took the pants off to dry. Aren't you naked? No, oh, no, the, no, I put, put them on the wet. and Austin was like, you're damp. And I'm like, uh, I'm damp. That's me. Yeah. Probably chafing like a mother. I mean, by, by, by now they're probably dry. Yeah. <laughs> it's hot out here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> does that does that answer your question? <laughs> <laughs> You're very confused. I'm happy? so confused. Like, <laughs> yeah, Erdus has drank many times. We've had so many bar scenes where Erdus has had beer. He just forgot. <laughs> he <laughs> drank. Did he drink milk though? Well, th there was. Yeah. But, but, yeah. I, but I drank. That was with my beer. I had beer and milk oh, yeah. that session. Get like some a milk. fucking Jaeger bomb with fucking whole milk. <laughs> He's fire. doing car bombs. Yeah. Yeah. The big foils are half and half. He's got a dog um, You guys all milk. cheers and you drink. And uh, after a few rounds, the, the, the guys are explaining to you, like, well, it, we, we do need to get back to schooling, so. Um, we should, are you okay with going now? Let's, let's hit it. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Hup, hup. And you guys, <laughs> together, take off into the desert. And then we take a break. And with that, we're going to take a fucking break. <laughs> <laughs> Good first set. Well, guys, we will see you very soon, and we appreciate you, and... Thanks for sticking around. Go buy Five. Dice from Dice Envy. Dice Envy! Dice Envy. And hey, go check out our website. It's thebottlecapbrigade.com. Not only does it have things on it, but it also has stuff. <laughs> Follow us on Reddit. Enjoy. <laughs> hey, hey everyone. Uh, my name is Sam. I, I play Ong in, in the show that you're probably watching right now. Um, so I, I, I would hope you knew that, but that's okay. If you don't, I'm, I'm just one of, of many. I don't, <laughs> I don't honestly know what this book even is. Anyway. Um, I just wanted to take a brief moment to let everyone know that we have a Patreon. Um, it's patreon.com slash the bottle cap brigade. You can go there and donate anywhere between um, $1 and $50 a month. Some of the tiers give you things like this or things like this and even these things. Any amount you can give, let's just continue making this amazing content for your entertainment digestion. And, and we appreciate you more than anything. Uh, love you. Hey, I'm Austin Townen. I am the DM for the Bottle Cap Brigade. And uh, this little video is about the world building that I did, the, uh, the world of Magna. You will get to hear about all the cool things, well, hopefully cool things, that I thought of for this campaign, uh, the Bottle Cap Brigade, which is what you're watching, so. So first off, Magna is one large connected continent with very little islands, uh, with four main countries, Kalak, Farkel, Musiv, and Salto. And they're all very different. So let's dive into what each one is about. First is Kalak. In Kalak, there are tons of nobles and almost no religion. They're very, very different uh, and very, very wealthy. Kalak is very disconnected from the rest of the continent and the other countries of Magna. They're full of rich nobles and a very prospering state. I mean, very little is known because it's so disconnected with the westward expanse in between, which is a giant icy tundra, uh, which very little people can pass through. So it makes it kind of hard to visit there. But people who do make that journey discover whole new traditions, different types of people, and a completely different culture than the rest of the world. After that is Farkle. Farkle used to be one of the most prosperous lands with tons of crops growing um, and a you know, pretty large revenue stream just from that. Uh, but over the last three to four years, crops have declined completely. The main city in Farkle is Marin. Marin is where our players started and where King Angel, the first of his name, lives. Next is Musiv. Musiv is more of a kind of Middle Eastern country. It's some sort of a, uh, an Arabic kind of feel. It's predominantly covered in deserts, with gold being the main import. They're deeply rooted in their heritage. And the last one is 
cell tone. Cell tone is kind of a uh, Spartan country. It's primarily focused on warfare and worships the god Jax, who is the god of war. Cell tone is also where the origination of the Great Hunt is. The Great Hunt is an international guild that is focused solely on defeating monsters and various fiends that cover the countryside. Next is religion. In the world of Magna, there is only one predominant religion, and that is the Holy See. The Holy See is broken into three parts. The first one is Jax. Jax is the only male god. He focuses on strength and power, and he's mainly worshipped in Saltone. The next god of the Holy See is Yahweh. Yahweh is the god of love and passion, and is worshipped in Farkle. And last but not least, is the god Nista. Nista is the god of cruelty and shadow, and is mainly worshipped in Musi. So that's a general overview of the world of Magna. I hope you enjoyed learning more, and let's get back to the session. We're live. Right on. Well, welcome back. Uh, this is the Bottle Cap Brigade, and Taylor, it, tell us about, you know, Dice Envy and stuff. So, if you haven't heard, we have a new partner with the Bottle Cap Brigade. They are the wonderful people from Dice Envy. If you haven't seen Dice Envy, they are one of the top artisan dice making companies on the interwebs. I sort of made that up, but it's still cool. Uh, go check out their website, we got a link below. Uh, one of the favorite things that we did here, they've got some mystery packs. So you pay like six bucks and they send you a mystery pack of acrylic dice and they are fucking rad. So go check them out, go check out Dice Envy and thanks for being a sponsor. They are literally the cheapest and best and uh, they, they, they are such good dice that uh, they will conquer the world. Facts don't matter right now. Yeah. Even though that still is a fact. Yeah. 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 Click the yeah. link. All right. We're going to go to another break. We're going to go to another course break. Um, all right. So we're back to our other four. Um, you guys join the caravan again, and you start to turn around this this giant corner, and suddenly these like uh, sand dunes have an opening in between, and it felt like they were cliffs for miles. And, uh, you guys continue, uh, our, like, to go through this, this channel, and, uh, it goes out into the ocean. You guys can hear the ocean waves. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> uh, I smelled a burp. Yeah. <laughs> I smelled a burp. Taylor burp. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, I can see what too. you guys are doing like, like, uh, like 15 seconds later So I just saw it happen oh, right. Miranda, Miranda did you smell it too? Uh, yeah I did actually yeah. Up in the production uh -huh. value uh, It opens up into the ocean And you guys can see a, a, a small uh, Fishing village Down at the bottom um, And you guys realize that you've you found Carmiel um, The whole uh, Like ground is like a, you can see water reflecting off of it, so it's it almost seems like a sunken town to the four of you. Have I been there before? Um, yeah, I think you maybe, yeah, maybe once. Hey, you guys, it's Carnegie. There's a bunch of those, <laughs> there's a bunch of those little fuck bags that shit on floors and run away there. Oh my God, there's our moment. 
Yeah. Hey, if you guys want to get weird about it, do you guys remember the, the pirate shanty that I taught you? No. You uh, I think so. A little bit. I'll, say, I'll, sing, I'll sing it again. You take a shot of rum, and you take a shot of rum. You take two shots of rum, then you take two more shots. Then you're drunk as fuck. All the shots are taken. Yeah. Like put your left foot. <laughs> Write it all down. <laughs> um, so if you, if you ever get into a spot, s- sing one of those two songs. And okay. those those pirate little fucks will think that you're one of those floor shitting sons of bitches, so you don't gotta worry about <laughs> that. Great. I'd like to continue on to town, please. Yeah. Okay. Great. <laughs> um, so, uh, yeah, it seems you guys start entering into this town. Um, no one's wearing shoes, and the water's up to your ankles. So, um, all of your feet are, are damp and you're, you're confused. It's like they live in this, like, two to three inches of water. Like, it's just everywhere. Is it up to my ankles or their <laughs> ankles? It, like, barely reaches the top arcs of your toes. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, they're so big. <laughs> <laughs> Compared to us. That's what she said. You're so big. <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> Well, what would you guys like to do? Are there, like, shops, or...? Yes, so let's open up the map. Uh, which one? I hope you... <laughs> yes, the town of Carmi Hill. Yes. I'm so glad that worked. Togu, I love how they just completely ditched us. <laughs> <laughs> um, you guys are entering on... Uh... As a party, we've never been good at staying together. <laughs> so true. We are 20, what, three episodes in or sessions in, and we've not figured out how to stay together. <laughs> I think, yeah, I, I don't make it easier. Um, yeah. So, yeah, there are four places in town. You guys are entering from the bottom of that, that map there. Um, so the first you can see, the sunken jug, which you guys know very clearly from the outside of this sh- shanty, horrible building that they sell alcohol. Um, then you also have the needle and prick. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Is that a whorehouse? Uh, the candlelight... <laughs> And, uh, Windy Sales. Windy Sales is the whorehouse. Uh, which one's a whorehouse? It's actually the sunken jug. <laughs> oh, oh, uh, dang it. <laughs> oh, it should be jugs, plural. Welcome to the oh, Bottle Cap Brigade, sorry, where we sorry. can't say prick without giggling. <laughs> yeah. Hard jugs. I knew we were going to laugh about that when I did it, too. <laughs> I, like, knew, like, I specifically thought you two would think this. <laughs> and I did. Yeah. Too good. Um, yeah, and you see a lot of people coming in and out of the, the sunken jug, um, but you can see a few more buildings in town, and it's right on the coast. Um, you see a couple ships docked off the edge, um, kind of near Windy Sails. Uh, what are, uh, what are the other shops? Uh, I, I'd like to go up to someone, uh, and say, hey, uh, is there anything of any, uh, like, is there a merchant in this town in which I could procure some equipment? Per chance, or just the first random person I see. Um, yeah, the, just surely. I mean, a, a, a needle and brick will will bend your items. Uh, thank thank you very much. Uh, yeah. it, do, are they relatively well priced? Oh, I, I I think she's very fair. Do you, do you want to sing a pirate shanty with me? <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, are you, are you a pirate? I mean, sometimes. <laughs> yeah, me too, me too. Yeah, so are I'm my friends. Uh, that one over there, and I point at uh, Jolie, I say, she's a fucking murderer. <laughs> <laughs> she, will, <laughs> she will fucking go so fucking hard. <laughs> I swear to God, I sleep every night scared for my fucking life. I kind of start to twirl a little bit. (laughs) Okay, let's do deception. Uh, Watch your goddamn, I swear to God, if she gets within five feet of you, fucking cover everything that matters to you. Uh, uh, Ten plus, uh, is this deception or intimidation? Ooh, I guess intimidation. Okay. Well, uh, no, deception because you're lying. Okay. You're not intimidating. Okay. It may intimidate. Just ten. 
yes. Okay. So, uh, this person looks back at you. Um, so like, what? Well, that doesn't. I mean, she she seems kind of. Normal. Uh, do you look, can you see me right now? Do you see how fucking big I am? I am fucking terrified of her. I swear to shit, if she, uh, dude, if you turn your back on her when she has a fucking knife out, she's like a god. Do you know what a ninja is? <laughs> I don't. Oh shit. Well, then, motherfucker, you have some shit to learn about the world. She will fuck you up. Just be careful. I go, I start I like slide in on the water like Sss. I'm like hey I'm a pirate. Arr. <laughs> this seems like it should be wow. Veggie Tales. I kind of flinch when she does that. <laughs> when she lands. <laughs> Interested, I realize it's so stupid. Like, yeah, I just don't care. Really. Okay. So the town where you found the dead pirate, and you guys convinced them that you were a pirate. Uh, yeah, and that jo- Jolie is the scariest fuck. She is a fucking blackbeard. She's, she's yeah, the pirate's the important part. Okay. Well. Um. Yeah, he's convinced at this point. As soon as she did that, like all jolly. Jolie. <laughs> uh, well, that's your brother. Never mind. Um, so can you get can you get us some discounts around here just so she doesn't freak no. the fuck out? He immediately yells, "Pirates!" Oh shit! <laughs> 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 You also see like a, a like almost like a like a dog has started to build a tunnel underneath one of the hud- like the huts. Uh huh. And I'm using nimble escape. Okay. <laughs> so I just get to hide. I'll choose the I'll choose the dog tunnel. God. So there's like the water dog tunnel you were describing. I'm in there. There's there's water on the ground, right? You so you like, like start dog. to go down and you're underwater. Is there any way for me to breathe at all? Yeah, but then you like come back up and you're like inside a hut. Oh god. <laughs> and it's not full of water. You just broke into this. <laughs> Am I hidden? <laughs> um, yeah. So you just walk through this room and there is just there is just a, a man in the corner. Uh-huh. If we call it a corner. Um, and it's it, he has like a slight covering, but you can still kind of see what he's doing, and it's clearly like their shower. Um, and you just see his back, and he's, you know, he's showering, and he, like, keeps, like, rubbing, like, the soap and stuff on his body. Is there anywhere inside of there for me to hide? <laughs> um, yeah, you know, there's, like, I guess a living room. <laughs> there's, like, a, uh, a chair. I'm gonna go hide behind the chair. <laughs> <laughs> like, chilly? Like, you can still see your duck feet. <laughs> Wait, who has duck feet? Yeah, he's <laughs> Well, his dead body. <laughs> no, I have yeah. duck feet. The dead body's normal. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What are you? What are you doing during this? I'm hiding. She. She's. She put the hat away. <laughs> <laughs> I like threw the hat away yeah. and then like ran. Yeah. Okay. Away. I was like, ooh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not a pirate anymore. <laughs> uh, yeah, you hide behind the chair. I just want to clarify. There is a front door. Okay. Good, good, I'm good. just gonna. I'm good, just gonna. Good. I'm just gonna like follow. I'm gonna follow Tech. I'm gonna follow into the dog tunnel. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. I don't know. There's no. What else? What else? You oh, need to do a stealth. Funny. Yeah. Oh. I have a sweet bonus action. Stealth, buddy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I like made this whole town. <laughs> And then you guys oh walk into the same pirates. So roll the 16. None of this matters anymore. Or 17. <laughs> 17. 17. Okay. So, hey! Um, yeah, you get it. You're also in there. Cool. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> what are Joe Lee and I faced with? And I... <laughs> um, well, you guys, you guys start to see uh, a lot of people start I'm to so come excited. running at you uh, with weapons. 
listen, uh, I'd okay. like to, I'd, I'd like to turn to the man and just say, listen. Uh, so there's there's two things. One, I was just fucking with you. Uh, uh, we're not actually pirates. We're very, uh, we're very tired. We just came from the desert, uh, and there was like some giant mantipede thing that was spitting green shit at us, uh, and we killed it. Uh, and our friends are lost, and we don't know how to find them. I used to be a pirate, which is why I was fucking with you like that, and we actually saw some <laughs> dead pirate. We saw some dead pirate back away. One of the, uh, what, what are they called? The slitters, right? Slitters. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he, he got fucked up, by, I'm guessing, by some of you guys in town. Uh, but uh, we got his necklace, and uh, I know they, did they come and, like, shit on your guys' floor? Or, like, fucking slap you guys on the way? Um, and the, the supposed like leader, strongest looking one, like approach you. Like, How do you know that? I do. Okay, so like I, I'm saying, like a decade ago, I used to be a pirate. I renounced my life, and I'm trying to do good to make up for it. I have a whole fucking backstory. I don't want to. <laughs> so you are, you are a pirate. No, I used to be a pirate, but I'm not no more. You're not a pirate anymore. Nah, but I would well, like to. What's a pirate? Always a pirate. <laughs> <laughs> she's kidding. She's kidding. She's very small. <laughs> and then the guy, the guy that originally yelled, he's like, "See, see, no, no, pirates!" No, no, check this out. Uh, no. <laughs> we, we're here to contribute to the local economy, and I'd like to pull out the bottle cap the, with the purple dragon on it, oh. and just say, I, "I have some currency that might be of interest uh, to you, trade and port types." Yeah, they start to rush at you and stop as you pull out this purple bottle cap. Yeah. So uh, if you could just uh, take me to your nearest uh, store, so I can buy a shield uh and then we can be on our merry way and not have a weird fight where i fucking kill all you guys that we don't <laughs> it's the most like passive, I'm gonna say, it's the the most passive aggressive shit ever it's yeah. like listen you should get me your stuff or i can kill you all right now <laughs> <laughs> i can say there's like 12 like fishermen coming at you with like spears i i could take them yeah <laughs> <laughs> so twelve of them. They each weigh like a hundred pounds. Yeah, Jolie would heal me until <laughs> they were all dead. Fair enough. Okay. Um, yeah, that's crazy. That's awesome. Yeah. Well, they uh, they look at you like that's a that's a mighty fine ball cap you got. I know. <laughs> I love how the rest of the continent enjoys bottle caps now, too. <laughs> and it's not just an us thing. We and you really the out? world economy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we yeah. Changed everything. We made that needle move. It makes me want it. Uh, it makes me want it. Listen, uh, I'll, I'll trade this if you have a real nice fucking shield um, and some other goods to restock some of my friends. Um, well, since you're pirates and you're invading our town. No, 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 no. Listen, we're not. I pirates. think we could just take the purple bottle cap away. I mean, you, guys. you can certainly <laughs> fucking try, but I recommend that you don't. Well, let's do intimidation. There you go. That's how you intimidate, by the way. I cast discussion. guidance on him. What oh, is that? shit. Is gonna... Wait. What does it do? I can't hear you guys. Oh, what does it do? What does guidance do? Oh, wait. What? What did you say? I can hear you now. What does guidance do? <laughs> It adds <laughs> My headphones keep getting out. Uh, you add a d4 to your roll. Yeah. Okay. Yay. Thanks. Oh my god. Uh, okay, so I got a total of. I'm so sorry. Grieve. Excuse me. Uh, <laughs> 12. <laughs> awesome. Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, he looks at you and, and thinks. So maybe it's a bad idea. Um, and to he force me to rest slaughter a, a village. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> he, workers. he thinks that he'll kill you, yeah. but that they will have considerable losses at the same time. Yeah, it's not worth it. Yeah. Um, Mutually assured destruction. And he's, he says, so, well, I guess I guess that makes sense. Yeah. Well, get out of town as at, soon as possible. At, as a, a bit of an olive branch, I'd like to uh, offer up my crab. And say, this is uh, Chuckles. Uh, he's my crab friend. I found him in the Chuckle. desert. Uh, and I'd just like to give him to you to say I'm sorry. I pull out my crab, too, and do the same. This is Lil, Lil Bon Bon. <laughs> <laughs> the crab with the bonnet to him. 
What is your name? It's the <laughs> sickest <Chuckles>. rap duo. <laughs> Chuckles, Chuckles and Lil Bamba. Lil Bamba. Lil Bamba. Also, if uh, I would I also finally like, figured out my rap name, Lil Bamba. I'd also like to offer to you all that if. Um, those slither fucking pirate pieces of shit come back. <laughs> if you guys can find me and get in touch with me, I will come and personally fucking massacre them for you. Really? Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm yeah, gonna... we'll, we'll steal all your rum, Mar. <laughs> <laughs> oh you see how not scary she is. <laughs> Really Everybody is like on edge this session. You know? like, <laughs> like so different. We're having a good time. <laughs> oh, what is wrong with my phone? Okay. I love it. That was, I mean, yeah. Um, so they just look at her confused, like, what? Okay, well, just, I mean, don't oh, don't shit. stay long. That's fine. All, right, all right, that's fine. Uh, take good care of Charles. It's taking. No <laughs> problem. <laughs> Um, LBB. <laughs> Let's do, uh, just a crisp. Lil, you down with LBB? Lil B. 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 Lil Lil B. Lil B. The base god. <laughs> yeah, you, he, I mean, it seems to you that he's, like, receptive. Cool. Yeah. <sighs> so, uh, there are four places in town, and they just kind of, like, move off to the side, all those guys, and they let you in. Um, you enter into town. Um, actually, let's open the town map again. To you, yeah. Uh, Tack, it, it's fine. You guys, come on out. It, it's not. Did we, were we able to hear that? <laughs> where? Yeah. In the hut? <laughs> oh, yeah, you guys are. <laughs> well, actually, let's do a perception roll. Okay. I'll pull it up in a second. <laughs> what do I perceive? Let's find out. <laughs> okay, you don't. You don't hear that. It took forever. Um, you do hear it. In fact, you heard the whole conversation. <laughs> I'm gonna start playing dead. By the chair. Yeah. And oh, you're just standing like right where you come out of that hole. You just eat naked, but goblin hiding behind chair. <laughs> Pretending to be dead. Yeah, you, and he's clearly I open visible. An eye. Like clearly visible to you. <laughs> You like sneaks. I'm just like, you, you don't look. <laughs> <laughs> There's a butt over there. If you're listening this, the, to us through the podcast version, uh, Tack just put his finger up to his mouth and just to say, shh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Well, um, do you want to. Not look at that anymore and leave. <laughs> yeah, I, that's why I closed my eyes. <laughs> I just like I just like walk up and like grab his arm and start pulling it out. <laughs> I go with. Okay. Yeah, she's pretty strong. So don't mess with her. Dude, this um, is just gonna it's just gonna be like my girl. Uh, <laughs> just, uh, just, uh, just, great just me uh, trying to save you all the time uh, and he gets stung to death keep by me away from the beast. <laughs> By, by Spoiler the alert to anyone who hasn't seen My Girl and it's not on me. <laughs> if you haven't seen My Girl by now, I've never seen My Girl. Well, cool. oh. Go see it. Um, Macaulay Culkin dies. In theaters. <laughs> Wait, yeah. is it Macaulay Culkin? I don't think it is. <laughs> it's the other is guy. It? That looks good. Kind of... Oh, a different white kid. <laughs> it's Macaulay Culkin. Is it a Thomas kid? No, it's Macaulay Culkin. I think it's Macaulay Culkin. It, 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 it so, is there a store <laughs> that I can go into? <laughs> So we're writing a needle. Camera. Yes. Needle yes. prick. Uh, yes, the only one. It is Macaulay Culkin. I totally nice. Think. Nice. Oh, yeah, needle out. and prick. <laughs> Map show. All right, yeah. Uh, yeah, you can see a, like a little sign that to you just means any vendor, but certainly has to do with do you clothing. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, I'd like to walk into that establishment. Okay. So... You walk in, and there's just, like, panels of cloth all along the walls. Um, and you can see, like, clothing fashioned, uh, like, adjustments being made in the back. Um, and it's, tell it's like, a, it's like a, a fashionable clothing store. All right. Uh, fashion? 
<laughs> Hello. Uh, also, I, first I'd like to yell back and say, Joe, Joe Lee, uh, to you, yeah, uh, Tech, if, if you all want to get some clothes, uh, I'm in a clothes store. <laughs> oh, it's around with what I have. <laughs> you, you look like shit. I Is say. it the vomit? <laughs> yes. Okay. Y'all, I think it's I think it's time for for an outfit update. Let's add let's add a little bit of zhuzh. Do we have a montage that we can do? Yes. Like us coming out of the dressing room and like, like others really looking good, and going like like, 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 like club. Oh man, I can only play that one song that I keep playing. That's okay. Uh, <laughs> then I'd like to turn back into the shop and say, uh, hello, is there anybody available to help us acquiesce some clothes? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, you walk in the shop. Yeah, um, so yes, we have uh, lots of shops in the needle and prick. Um, <laughs> what's what's you your name? Uh, Charles. Hey, Charles. How howdy doody. Uh, my name's uh, Ong. <laughs> howdy doody. <laughs> well, it's, it's wonderful to meet you. That's, That's what you mean. It's wonderful to meet you too. Uh, <laughs> Uh, do you have any, uh, is it just clothes, or do you have, like, maybe a shield? Um, a shield, uh, <coughs> a shield f- from the sun, from the prying eye of culture, from yourself. That was some <laughs> deep-ass shit. I appreciate it. Mm-hmm. I was talking more of the defensive type to protect you against arrows mm-hmm. and swords and swords. Yes, right. Well, I wouldn't say we have anything of that particular nature. That's okay. Do you have anything that uh, could uh, more effectively cover my junk and nips? <laughs> <laughs> I think that, however, sir, we have awesome. covered. I'm very large. She's just like <laughs> metal paste. Uh, oh. <laughs> there's yeah, there's yeah. shells like Ariel. <laughs> <laughs> that is what I want. <laughs> Uh, well, um, what kind of attire are you looking to buy? I mean, honestly, I don't give a shit what it looks like. I just want it to be functional. Functional before him, as um, I say. What kind of function? Uh, any sort of, uh, anything that will boost my, uh, ability to speak to people or fuck people up, you know? Just I like, anything that... I, like, walk up and I'm like, you should get something with spikes. Do you yeah. have stuff with spikes? Spikes or fucking <laughs> plates or fucking, like, if, if you don't have any of that shit, maybe some shit that'll make me more resilient against, like, weather. Not You're gonna get so hot. much BDSM. Well, <laughs> I think I think we need some shoulder pads, yeah. some real elaborate shoulder pads, yeah. like Gaga shoulder pads. Protection pads. against the sun. Like, protection against yes. like getting fucked up by the elements. <laughs> How many times can you listen to this song in a row? As many as we need. It's a it's great song. It hasn't stopped. Subscribe no. to us on Patreon to so we playlist. don't have to play this song. It is a one minute song. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah, well, and he starts like sketching things up on this little pad that he has, and he comes up this beautiful thing. It's like, full of... He turns it around, um, and you just you see these amazing shoulder pads, um, spikes, which he referred to as thorns, are very in right now, um, and goddamn covered, right, covered the shoulder pads. Uh, how much would you like for that, kind sir? Um, well, I mean, you don't have to pay it all at once if you can't. Um, but of course, something of that nature would cost at least 12,000 gold. What does that convert to in bottle caps? <laughs> well, yeah. um, you can't. That, uh, it's, what is, it's a lot. More than it, you have. Was he being funny? funny? Bottle, bottle cap. I, I'd like to show him the purple bottle cap. <laughs> oh, yes. That's not quite 9,000 gold, but... Um, you, you said 9,000? Indeed. Oh. Uh, well, I don't have that kind of money. Um, what what does it do for me? Um, I mean, with my art expertise, you'll be <laughs> the talk of the town. Yeah, it, it, will it make me, like, more resilient? <laughs> <laughs> 
not be more resilient to their stares, <laughs> to the eyes of corruption, to government, to life. <laughs> Can I do an investigation on the article of clothing to see if it'll actually give me any sort of benefit whatsoever? Yes. Okay. What role? Like investigation, not okay. perception. Yeah. Okay. Let's investigate. Okay. I got a 12. Yeah, I mean, to you, it's like, that is an incredible work of art. This guy is really, in, 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 like, just an artist. It's wowing you. Does anyone want to buy this for me? I can't do that. Sorry. Hey, Austin. <laughs> hey, Austin. Hey, don't have like, a hey, lot to him. Yeah. Could I possibly use thaumaturgy to talk to this man as Jax? Oh, dude, you could totally do that. Yeah. 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 I want to get him to make these for us very cheap or for free. Okay. <laughs> what does he, he hear? He just hears, like, a... You can put the song back on. I can't. <laughs> I can't listen to it again. <laughs> do you have, like, a... Do you have a, a good, like, little, just, like, waiting, like, ringtone? Oh, man, yeah. I don't. Uh... <laughs> He's like, no, just explain the So thing. unfortunate. Oh, man. I wish I had something. So... I'll put on battle music. Okay. Nice. Cool. There we go. It's intense. It just like he just starts hearing like war drums and like battle music and screaming, and uh, in his head, and he just uh, hears ha, uh, hello, hello there. Is that is that you, humble store clerk? God. Uh, yes, one of them. Um, yes, it's uh, Jax speaking to you. Uh, now I see that you are uh, causing a, a stir with not ch charging these heroes far too much for your uh, quote unquote art. Let's do a deception roll for me, dear. Okay. I'd also uh, <laughs> like to tell her, uh, just kind of secretly, that his name is Charles. 17? His name is Charles. 17? Okay. Um, you seem to just like shake his head and he looks back at you guys. Gotta turn this music off too. <laughs> just everything. There we go. Bam. Um, turns back to you and, uh, well, I, I, think, I think maybe I've been, been treating you uh, rather poorly. Of, of course, if you have um, a purple bottle cap. And he just hears, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Jack's out. So, um, <clears throat> it's kind of it's warm in, in here. Um, Is it? <laughs> how, how about just 300 bottle caps? Is that okay? Um, uh, yeah, as long as you throw in the purple one, of course. Well, how about just the 300 bottle caps and I let you hold the purple one and then I take it back? Oh, uh, sure. That'd, that'd be, that'd be, All right. That'd be fine. So I do that. Hey, do you think you can make me something too? Um, absolutely. Uh, will, 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 the, will the gentleman be buying that for you as well? Oh, no, no. I have my own money. Wonderful. Um, and then, what would you like? So, um, she goes, I need stuff that's going to protect my small little body, because I get, we're heroes, and we come and come across a lot of, um, you know, dangerous things, and it's pretty hot here, and uh, as you can see, um, I don't think I've bought clothing since I was seven. Yeah, it's really... Like, the shirt's just, like, torn, and it literally it just yeah, looks like just it's patched. Like it, best. it looks like it's just patched and, like, yeah. sewn out of just random bits of fabric. Way too small. To make, make it longer. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> it's just the same shirt. <laughs> yeah, you just look like a tall mess, and he's just staring at you like, Yes, well, I, I've, I've been told not to judge, but certainly I, I, I think it could help you. I, I like him smiling at him, just, like, really sweaty, and, like, my hair is super unbrushed. It's yeah. just, like... <laughs> Just like a sweaty little 13 year old that just like ran around like the, the, the tennis court. Very sweaty. And he turns over to the side and he's like, you, you mentioned that you're looking for something to keep your enemies from harming you. Right. Well. Something that's light too. You know, I have just the thing. I will, I will say that this particular item, even though I, I will be giving you a considerable discount, uh, will we'll 
still be quite costly. I'm, I'm uncertain if it's worth bringing up. Well, just bring it up. Bring it up. <laughs> well, it's normally... Well, well, how cool will I look in it? Will I look like a hero? If only they could see you. Hmm. Can you see me in it? I can see you in it, but if, if you wear it, maybe I can't see you in it anymore. Hmm. I think really? I know where he's going. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hate shit. that. Bring it up. Bring I said this right after, it's like, ooh. Yeah. Um, okay, and he says, are, are you sure it's it's normally 12,000 gold? And for, and for you, I'll, I'll sell it for five. Oh. <laughs> I'll buy it. <laughs> I give you guys so much gold that I'm like not worried about it. Yeah, we fun. all have so much gold. <laughs> don't worry, I don't Except either. you two. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I have really 1,000 gold. gold. <laughs> and I just like. Because you feel don't like, have your. I don't know how much I have. Yeah, you don't have your gold. Is it on the body though? Yeah. I asked. I, I, I tell him I want it. Yeah, I oh, guess oh, you oh, got it. So do I have it on my Yeah, fair enough. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're right. <laughs> you're totally right. Can I see it? That was an awesome laugh. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, uh, I guess that is the question. And you see her pull up this thing. And it's like literally... <laughs> she dropped her dice. Yeah. <laughs> that noise is amazing. <laughs> it's a little less climactic <laughs> online. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Um, uh, 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 I dropped my dice. It was like a. Okay. Ooh! Okay. Um, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> the letter of the day is. Um, he, he pulls out this outfit, and it's like a really long, tall tee. It's like. <laughs> a t shirt? Um, and, and a tall yeah. tee. Oh. Yeah. And okay. it's clearly like. An attempt, <laughs> an attempt at camo. Oh my god! <laughs> an attempt at I'm sorry. Camo? In a, an attempt in what way? <laughs> it's like a where did they fail? It, <laughs> it was a very light linen that they then covered in like stencil leaves. Oh, <laughs> that switch like, from like nice a light one. green to a dark green. That's nice. Mm. Um, <laughs> I'm like. Yeah, see, that's not exactly the look I was um, picturing. Um, and she just waves it. She's like, "Did you see that?" And it like disappears for you have a second. Did you oh. see how it blends in with its surroundings? Do I? T can I? Or is <laughs> yeah, it a perception roll? <laughs> or does it just look like they just flashed like camouflage in front of a wall, like a shirt? I'm gonna be upset if I fail. He was just gonna let you see it too. <laughs> I guess what? It's like the six. Oh, six. Um, I feel like this tall tee has like a fake muscular person in a bikini. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like it's one of those like tall tees. I would love that. I want one of those ones with like the hairy chest. Um, yeah, for like a second it disappears. And then she waved it. Or he waved it. Hmm. Well, I gotta try it on first. Well, of course. We have our um, changing room in the back. Sweet. I'm gonna go put that shirt on. Yeah, okay. <laughs> um, you just like snatch it from him. It's like, oh. And then you take it. Oh. <laughs> um, and you put this on, and there's not like a mirror or anything. <laughs> right. But you're just like, oh, this feels nice, snuggy. Feels right. Snuggy. Cool. I just uh sponsor? No. Yes. <laughs> I like walk I like walk out and I'm like I like look I wanna like look down at Yeah. At it. Um you feel a little like stealthier. Um sweet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, so here's the dilemma I'm having. I the design is terrible. <laughs> That's rather hurtful. It was a um, a new. Well, it's not idea terrible. It's just I feel like you could modify it a little bit. In what way? Give it a hood. Oh. I'm sorry. A, a hood. Ah, you want to cover yourself from the sun. Right. 
And from like the prying eyes of whatever you said before. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I get I get excited about good gotcha. improv. That was a callback, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Hello. He said it. Damn it, guys. <laughs> um, I'm barely. That was yeah. good. <laughs> I have no idea. Like, that yes. Was good improv <laughs> handshake. Yes. I cannot shake anyone. Freaking nailed it. Life wow. of me. I always I, uh, I accidentally hugged this one what? chick's bishop <laughs> on accident. Like, yeah, shake people's hands. <laughs> okay, he turns back to you and says, "Yeah, I, yeah um, <laughs> we certainly could um, add um, an exterior coverage on top, uh, but it'll, it'll cost about sixty-five hundred gold for that addition." Sixty-five hundred gold. Yes, and that's with godly prices. Sixty-five hundred to put a hood on this. Oh, total, uh, an additional fifteen hundred dollar deal. Oh. That case. Let's do it. Okay. <laughs> God. Oh, I'm sorry. All right. Yeah. Great. Yeah. So they so so <laughs> sixty five hundred gold. No, um, a couple hours later. Let's say you guys waited. <laughs> a couple hours later, it comes back out. Um, and he gives you this thing. Um, and you pay sixty five hundred gold for it. Um, and it has an interesting ability. Um, so you put this on, and you're like camo as fuck, you know, and um. It is an item that you have to activate. You can use it once per day. And you either get a plus three to stealth, or something else happens. <laughs> Sketch. Just See, uh, quickly. I don't like the fact that you say something else happens. Because it has <laughs> negative connotations. The fitty fitty. Talking to your mic. <laughs> uh, does, uh, did, does the, did the clothes that I got do anything? Oh yeah, they finish yours. It looks really silly. Do, but do they do anything? <laughs> no, they're, they're their shoulder pads made out of linen. Sick. Um, <laughs> I, I sport them. It looks like they don't count as oh, armor. Oh, they have like little like cones. It yeah. looks like the inside of like my mom's sport jacket from like '94. They don't. They don't. They don't count as armor, it's like right? Foam. <laughs> no AC. No, bonus. no AC yes. bonus whatsoever. Yeah. Those shoulder pads bring out your eyes. Your cheekbones look so lifted. I look You're ready fucking, to hear a fucking pirate. Bitchin'. Dude, you look like a hero. <laughs> Tap Rob, it. What do you think? You, you look, uh, sneaky. Sneaky. <laughs> <laughs> you look sneaky. 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 Ong wanted a blacksmith so bad, and everyone just went to Nordstrom's. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay, I got to spend bottle caps for the first time in the entire campaign. Other than just flicking them against the clock. Yeah. Yeah. Tack would like to purchase a, like a headband. <laughs> um, yes, it's, it's a, a headband of, of what color, shape, size, design. The right shape for my head. <laughs> well, if you want my... If you want my personal opinion, um, mm -hmm. and you, you're like, he's like, may I? Of course. Um, and he starts to like kind of massage your head, and it oh. feels quite relaxing. He's like going all the way around, like, mm, yes, yes. Like my body. Like, you're you're basically this, like, just doing that bug's like, body chain, right? Like. Yeah. <laughs> hey. <laughs> yes. <laughs> And uh, he just checks all the way around your head. He's like, interesting. He does like over your jaw and over your nose and like all these different places, like on your upper body for no reason. Because he's like, I think I know exactly what would work for your perplexion. <laughs> As eh? <he's> recently <laughs> sick. <laughs> As I become perplexed. Yeah. <laughs> um, and he, he comes back with like this, it's literally like a wavy cut. Right? And it's, uh, it's bright pink. I just need something to keep the sweat out of my eyes, so this will work. Um, yeah. And then on the inside, it just has like a little like male symbol. You can see it when you're putting it on. I flip it around so you can see it on the outside. <laughs> <laughs> In this one town, it's a specific brand, but anywhere else, it's just the symbol of male. I'd like to give Tack my cone shoulder pads to put over his nipples. If you would like them, yeah, like, like, like under wrong. my shirt. Yeah. <laughs> would you like? We're going them, back Tap? to the fifties. Damn. Um. 
I don't. Mm. This doesn't sound super comfortable, and I don't. I, I I would assume it would up your defensive capabilities. <laughs> uh, do I have a choice or? Yeah, I'm just I'm trying to be. I'm you trying always to be nice. have a choice. <laughs> I'm trying to be nice here, Wear little this. friend. I mean, maybe I'll borrow them for a special disguise. Try try them out. Whenever you want, just okay. keep it in mind. I, yeah, yeah. I will. I'm gonna write it down in my notebook. Nobody <laughs> <laughs> believes that. That's the option. Is it your handy dandy number? Oh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, uh, I, I'd like to go fuck something up. Joe Lee, did you need anything from here? I want to get you to said a up at the end of that too. <laughs> No, 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 I'm good. I'm good. Yes. Uh, do, you guys, do you guys want to go fucking like either find our friends or beat some shit up or like kind of both? Maybe? Yeah, or take your shit in the street like those pirates. Let's do it. Yeah, I'll follow your lead. Why do you want to shit in the street so bad? Joe, you're, you're wilding. I'm just having a real good time trying to be a pirate. It's it's great. There's more to being a pirate than just shitting in the street. I would know. I have the jewelry of a dead pirate. <clears throat> Uh, well, that's most uh, of being you. a pirate. <laughs> Trust me. Oh, probably because of dysentery. Yes. And, and the lack of oranges. Uh, I'd like oh. to leave the shop. Yeah, shit. Um, <laughs> so with that, we're going to take a break. <laughs> um, and we will see you very, very soon. Fucking America. America. We got two of them.